welcome back to Night In with Manta. Woo! Woo! We've been reading The Golden Forest. It has been so much fun. It's so crazy. These are our last final two episodes. I'm so sad because I love it so much. Mm. But before we dive into this amazing fun reading and, and discussion, let's first introduce ourselves and who we will be playing. This side. Just kidding. <laughs> this side. Oh. Dealer's choice. <laughs> Just kidding. This side. <laughs> I'm Emma. I'll be playing Wen <laughs> Yang. Hi, I'm Eva, and get ready, because I'm playing guard one. Oh, Whoa. get ready. Okay. Hi, I'm Rock, and I will be Coon. Hi, I'm Ren, I play Telcos, Ningle Sarbok, narrator and sound effects. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, and do. I'm Ashley, and I'll be Humba. Woo! Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Before we dive into this episode, let's get a quick summary to remind us what has just happened. That will be written, written? That will be read by the lovely Rock. <laughs> In the handful of episodes leading up to episode 48, you can just feel that we're building to something huge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Renier has been sent by Gazita northward to assassinate Kuhn. Mm. And if that isn't bad enough, she's forced to pair up with a mud person Ew. named Telkos. <laughs> <laughs> Telkos is prone to causing trouble, <laughs> like giving away their position to the gondola on patrol led Dummy. by Kuhn. The two attempt to pass as cotton merchants, but are taken captive by Kuhn and sent back to Salt City. <laughs> Once they arrive in Salt City, things get intense real quick. Kuhn accuses Renier of being an assassin. <gasps> Telcos basically admits to everything, and we all brace for the violent duel that's unfolding right before our very eyes. Oh, Let's see how it all goes down in episode 48. <gasps> I'm so oh, nervous. Let's, Let's do it. it. He must be out of his mind. He already thinks we're spies sent from the Golden Forest. Why add fuel to the fire by talking about the Golden Forest even more? <laughs> I went Not to the Golden crying. Forest to buy clay blocks <laughs> and a trace. They told me that if I'm going to the Northland, I'll need an errand boy to help me out. Oh, he, no. he told me I could take one of his best slaves. Oh. How could I possibly have disobeyed the orders of such a high-ranking person? Girl, pick up your face. Mm -hmm. I can't. So you mean to tell me that the priest from the Golden Forest forced you to bring him with you? Lugal, it's not true. He said he was in need of an errand boy, and the priest suggested he take me since I happened to be in the room and had no urgent tasks for the time being. I promise that that's all that it was. Hmm. Which one of you is lying? <laughs> is it him? Point. Or is it you? <gasps> uh, no, the Galtier said. The Galtier? The, the, that damn merchant. In the end, those loose lips of his have put us both in hot water. That's not true, Lugal. Please believe me. Telkos, are you crazy? Why would you tell such lies? Uh, but, Renny, you're... Swing. Mo. Slam. Mo. <gasps> ah! Your scheme to shut your master up is wicked. Renier of Eld Isle. <laughs> master? How could that lying, self-serving man possibly be my master? Oh. Tie him up. Grab. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark. Eee. Nothing I say will convince him otherwise. And if that's the case... She Whoosh. I'll need to focus on just saving myself. Stop. Jump. Yo, you look Yeah. Oh, it's getting crazy. Yeah. What? How is he so strong? Is he even human? Lugo! Land! Lugo, please! J j just wait a minute! Tell me why the Galtier sent you. Everyone stay in your places. One by one, I'll cut off the boy's limbs as I question him. <gasps> Ew. Until ultimately, <laughs> I'll uncover the Golden Forest vicious scheme. Yes, yes sir. sir! Grab. Uncover the scheme? Isn't it already obvious what that scheme now is? I was ordered to come and kill you, you idiot. If it weren't for those orders, I wouldn't have had any reason to come to this godforsaken place again. Lugal, I'm being unjustly punished. I swear to the gods that I'm just... Swing. Swoosh. <gasps> Duh. Oh. oh. She's agile. Mm -hmm. Oh. He's stronger and more agile than I could have <laughs> ever imagined. 
he's stealthy and incredibly vigilant, too. Had I not been able to gauge the direction of his attack, I'd already be dead. An innate gift with the sole purpose of killing others. A bloody king who's eradicated an entire tribe and united the Northland in one fell swoop. Kun, the Lugal of Salt City. The boy who once smiled so purely and sincerely. Aww. The boy who once touched my body so delicately Aww. so as not to hurt me. Oh, hold on now. <laughs> that boy, where did he disappear to? He's a man, Renier. Mm -hmm. <laughs> His ax swings faster and faster with each attempt. I think I'll only be able to escape it one or two more times. Oh, no. And maybe it's because he's considering his honor as king, or because he doesn't think it's necessary. But his warriors aren't getting involved in this fight. They've stayed put, just as they were told. If you return from successfully completing this mission, I'll fulfill your greatest desire, Renier. But do you even know what my greatest desire is, Gazita? For this mission, you must take the life of the person who happens to be. This is my only chance to kill Kun. This is my last order, so return safely, Renier. The thing is, I don't think I will be able to return safely. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Slice! Oh, no. uh, your eyes are more beautiful than I ever imagined, Kun. Goosebumps. Day. Stab! Oh. I'm right in the neck! Oh. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Patter, patter, patter. Falter. Oh, no. Are you? <gasps> in that short moment, Her hair's blonde. he managed to turn his body and avoid a fatal injury. <gasps> the sky, it's so clear, so blue. I, I need to get up, but my body, it feels too heavy. Even still, I've done all I could. This... Blonde. What's he doing? Her hair's blonde. This brand. I know someone with this same brand on their chest. How could I forget that symbol? That night is engraved in my mind. <gasps> that strange brand that I'd spotted on her chest was in the shape of a tree. <gasps> Renier of Eld Isle? Who are you? The Golden Forest. The Golden Forest. The Golden Forest. Renier! Renier! I'm... I'm so sorry! Oh, so loud. Renier of Eld Isle, answer me! My head's ringing from all the noise. Who really are you? Explain why a woman's here dressed like this! Huh? How did he find out? Well, maybe this idiot's just strangely <laughs> good at recognizing things like this. This idiot. He's so stupid. <laughs> Dog <Don't> him! <laughs> And explain what that brand is. What on earth is this tree symbol all about? Hmm? Answer. Answer me. Da, 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 da. Hark. <gasps> Grab. Fall. Ooh. She has golden hair. Mm. Da, 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 da. Wait a minute. They're a bit too far, so I can't really see, but was. Renier's hair always that color? No, no it wasn't. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it was brown. Mm -hmm. Left. Lugal, what are you planning on doing with her? We're going to Salt City. <gasps> Call a doctor. Bring Ningle Sarbot to my room right away. <gasps> strike, strike, what strike. What the hell's going on right now? All I can say is, it seems our Lugal, the best warrior in all of the Northland, has met a worthy match. Mm. None of us royal guards were able, able wow. <laughs> None of us royal guards were able to withstand 10 rounds with the Lugal. Mm. But that skinny little slave from the Southland was able to avoid every single one of the Lugal's attacks wow. and even leave a mark on our Lugal's neck. Mm -hmm. Everyone who witnessed the fight saw what happened firsthand. And oddly, in the end, that slave did absolutely nothing to protect herself. She stabbed the Lugal knowing she'd die. Had the Lugal not instinctively turned to avoid the attack, he too would have died with her. Mm. But what was most shocking of all was what happened afterwards. Beneath the slave's tattered clothes was a cloth, a cloth wrapped tightly around her chest, which indicated that the Southlander was a woman. 
<sighs> In that moment, our legal seemed to have seen something, something that suddenly made him bring the slave to Salt City. Mm. The Lugo's now been by her side for the gods know how long. Ningle Sarbot, why hasn't she woken up yet? You know, it's a miracle <laughs> she didn't die on the spot, Lugo. Mm. This is why I've always told you, you must control your strength. If you don't save this woman, uh, I'll kill you. Mm, <laughs> Calm down. Submissive. Okay. <laughs> Lugal, were you kicked out again? No, she just told me to wait outside so that I wouldn't interfere with the patient's treatment. That means you were kicked out, Lugal. <laughs> <laughs> but then again, maybe he really wasn't, considering Mother's personality. She surely wouldn't have kicked him out with kind words. He'd definitely know he was being kicked out. You're getting on my nerves, so get out of here. <laughs> I don't understand. My hands would never make such a mistake. Swoosh. Pow. Oh. Dot, 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 dot. Hope you didn't do that in front of the patient. Slam. I know why the Lugal's so out of it. It's because that woman's been in a coma for the past few days. Stop, stop, but still, stop. it doesn't change the fact that he still needs to fulfill his regular duties. For the past few days, he's pushed back to trials and conciliation meetings and has held off from making important decisions and holding memorial services at the temple. Step, step. All of his tasks are adding up, but because the elders all fear the Lugal's deadly glare, they're too busy avoiding him to say anything. And so, as one of the few warriors close to him, I must tell him today. Sweet. Lugal, there's something we need to address. You see, there's a, li a long list of matters awaiting your approval and final say. Five elders have already made vain attempts to speak with you this morning. Ha! All they do is argue every day anyways. What difference does it make for them to do so a few more days? But Lugal, what about services at the temple? It's the first day of the month. You must hold memorial services at the temple and bless the newlyweds. You as the high priest are responsible for blessing our new couples so that they may grow old together in peace. But what good would a blessing from a quack priest like me do? Would newlyweds truly want to receive a blessing from me if they knew I was living a chaste life in solitude? Lugal, she's passed away. Slam. No, she's not dead. Lugal, please, she's no longer with us. The gatekeeper who returned your act said so. It hasn't been confirmed. I refuse to believe it without seeing her corpse. You've looked high and low for her. Don't you think you've waited for her long enough? It's time to move on. Find a new woman for yourself. Lugal, you're the only descendant of the giant eagle and the last surviving member of the Salt City tribe leader's family. You need an heir. And you can't have one without having a wife first. My wife came to the palace to see me that day. I have a wife, and her death hasn't been confirmed. So I'd be completely wrong to father an heir with a woman who isn't my wife. But without an heir, the lineage of the Salt City tribe will die with you. I never said I'd never have an heir, Humba. In fact, I'm going to have hundreds, no thousands of heirs with my beautiful queen. It's a lot of work, you know. Mm -hmm. My child might be alive somewhere. The queen could have already had my child. So I can't stop searching, not until I know for sure. Step, step. Seriously, nobody's as stubborn as the Lugal. <laughs> so as his liege, there's a lot I must do for him. <laughs> I really hope he'll eat this. He's hardly eaten these past few days. He's been completely focused on that young woman. Lugal, may I enter? Mother says she's gotten better, so I wonder when she'll finally wake up. I barely managed to keep her in stable condition. Mm. Clunk. Lugal. <gasps> Lugal? What? No! 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 Wait, what's happening? We don't know! No! No! We don't know what's happening. I'm so bummed. Oh, no. Is it like a little cut her head? Oh my god. Yeah. Wait, hello. It looks like a caress with an axe. Yeah. If that's possible. With Uter. Like Uter. Uter. Like we a soft, Uter. sharp caress oh, on the man. cheek. He's going crazy. Sir. So we're really not gonna know. Guys, I gotta go home and read the rest of this yep. immediately. Oh my I'm god. I'm just. But how does he not know? 
He never saw her. Remember, he was blindfolded. But how has he not put it together at this point? I feel like he's slowly piecing, piecing it together. Because yeah. he, he saw the brand and then he was like, wait, instead of letting this slave die, I will take her and get her. But the Thanks. brand didn't totally give it away for him. So oh, yeah. other people could be branded. Yeah, that's true. Times. There's lots of cults out there. There's with that's <laughs> yeah, a lot of a lot of the slaves get branded. So he's not for sure. I think he wants to wake her up and ask mm -hmm. her questions, and then she'll probably dive. Oh, I don't know. I mean, that sounds like his tactic most of the time. Right. You know, answer yeah. my question, or I'll tell you from then. Yeah, exactly. It's, yeah. it's been working for it's him. It's been though. working. He's for a him. man of yeah. few thoughts. Right. And lots of action. Lots of action. Lots of action. But we know that he's been waiting for her. Yeah, Wait, so, so all this time we thought she was married, but he was actually just waiting for her. I know. He's like, she so might have sad. my baby. Oh, I yeah. said, did he? That's adorable. When they. That's sad. So they'll. They no protection. Okay. Also, was he not blindfolded? In that shot, when they were having sex, yeah, yeah, yeah he, was. he was. He yeah, was. Yeah, he's she oh, never took the I blindfold off of him. <laughs> I can see that. Yeah, Wait, but then how, they got real pinky. How did he see the the? Yeah, because he saw the brand. He felt it. I thought. Oh. No, there's a scene where he, you see his face. I thought, yeah, I thought there was. And no... he saw the because oh, she turned off the light. She took off his blinds. Oh. Okay, that's right. Oh. She was glowing. I knew it. It's something like that. Ah, yeah. Wow. So he recognized the brand. So he's seen the branding wow. before mm -hmm. on her. Oh my God! You guys have both been waiting for each other. Just do it. Just, just say this you is love so each other. But she's still bound to. I'm stressed for her. <laughs> yeah, I just feel like yeah. She's finally found mm -hmm. someone she loves, and neither one of them thought they'd ever find somebody, and they, they found each other. I know. I think it's gonna work out, guys. I don't know. I feel it. I feel it. I'm, I'm just, just so something frustrated. feels like too good to be true. No, no, no don't say that. But he doesn't even know who oh, she man. is yet. What if he's like, nah, I thought I wouldn't you? It's like, nah, now that I see your face. Just yeah, like a no. quick 180. <laughs> yeah. it's like, but, uh, nah, I don't yeah. want no blonde girl. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> the most beautiful good. woman is yeah. not. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I, I, I wish them well, but I don't know. Something still feels a little off about Gazita. But you know what's cool oh, about yeah. this love story oh, yeah. is that you don't often back. see the two lovebirds fighting each other and stabbing mm -hmm. each other in the Ooh. neck. I'm yeah. here for There's it. Death. I'm not. There's what's love without war. <laughs> <laughs> what's love without a little stabbing? And yeah, yeah. Just, just yeah little and stab, she's stab. she's strong for her size because yeah. they said that none of the guards could ever get anywhere close to him. I mean, she stabbed him in the neck. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah she still survived. I mean, she has beaten the crap out of a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. she's yeah. also yeah. well deserved. But yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah. very well deserved. Sure. Yeah. yeah. He found his match in more ways than one. <sighs> oh, yeah. I, I like that. He found his match in more ways than one. Be sure to stay tuned because we have another great title from Monta Comics coming for you next month. Night in with Monta, the Golden Forest. It's been crazy. It's been fun. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.